Hello, Mateen.
you've known in advance that there is live streaming, as you can see, and the footage will be projected tomorrow on the poll. So if you are not okay with that, I'm not sure that you will have to go. Um, and it's, it's very important that you stay for the whole hour, if possible. Uh, we will finish at 8 o'clock. And uh, otherwise, okay, of course, you are free to leave whenever you want, but you might be asked to give us a short feedback explaining why you are leaving, just because it's very important for us. Thank you. Today I was in the closest museum, on the floor of the other monuments, and it was raining a bit then, and I want to go to the museum, it was closed, closed because uh, there was a I think there was a big demonstration, uh, all the public workers. We couldn't go to one part of the documenta too because the museum was closed at the night. So now we're here. They were on strike because of uh, wages and their retirement. That's it. Thank you. I think we should be here. I think we should be here. Why? 
because it's good to be in, in a place uh, and you're committed to when you arrive there. Here instead of where? Well, you can only be in one place at a time. Do you have any guilt about it? Do you feel guilty? are imposed by a German government to Greece and we are obliged here to entertain you. You're not obliged. This is what we're doing here, Richard. Well, I mean, I came here to have a dialogue and uh, so if you don't feel that you can talk to me that way, I don't, I don't quite get it. I should feel personally guilty for what is going on on a global level. Frankly, I came here to, to open my mind, okay? This is the first time I'm here in Greece and I kind of expect the same thing from you and not to impose any preconceived notion of who I am or what I stand for. And so that's really what you think. I think you don't know who I am. Who are you and what do you stand for? What's that? Who are you and what do you stand for? So um, I, I've been, I left Germany 21 years ago. And I live in Los Angeles, and I don't necessarily agree with what the German government is doing and what's going on in Europe. Uh, and I left for various reasons that have to do with mentality uh, and the way people see life in my home country. And so I don't know. I I. I'm a world citizen in my eyes, and so I try to be that as much as possible and be as open as possible about it. And so, I don't know, that's maybe the best answer I can give you. Do you have any other questions? Could you, please, could you please explain those problems or the what? could you please explain those problems? Well, you know there's a mentality uh, in Germany that I never agreed with, which was uh, there was always this very rule-oriented thinking that never allowed the view of the outside or limits the view of the outside at times and uh, that I never liked and that's the reason, that's probably one of the reasons why I left. I mean I come back every year, I visit Europe every year, so it's still my home, but you know that's one of the reasons why I left. Do you find your answers in Los Angeles? 
Who are you talking about? I do find your answers. Answers? Uh, yeah, and the, the answer was gefunden. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. I, I, I mean, we all try to find ourselves. I just wanted to be with my friend. And so, no, I have a time for all the answers. What's been good? Yeah. Thanks for sharing. Do you blame uh, for some of uh, the Greeks? I don't blame them. I mean, who am I to know what, what is the problem? It's uh, very complex, the world. And when you start Asking questions, then. That's I don't know, I think it's um, from America, around the Dutch. I mean, what I don't think is what you see is the problem. Right? I mean, it's not, it's, it goes, you know, it's your country. <laughs> and uh, what would you do uh, to make things better? I mean, every single one that asks me that question should, you know, have an answer to that, too. I think that uh, uh, I prefer to, for us to be more responsible in everyday duties. You try and be? Uh, yes. I think that I am more than. How you do that? Hmm? How you do that? Uh, yeah. I work a lot of hours. Uh, not eight hours, about ten, uh, eleven sometimes. And no, I'm not done. No, I'm not done. Take charge. Take charge. Yeah, uh, take charge. Uh, uh, other other uh, person's uh, duties in my job. Uh, unfortunately. So what do you do? What's your job? I'm a special uh, educationist. Are you on strike right now? No. I rare uh, do strike. But you are more responsible than the other. Uh, than the other, uh, uh, than my uh, colleagues. That's the way I feel. Do you think the strikes have lost their uh, purpose and meaning and power? No, I don't think so. Uh, no, I think that uh, there is a meaning. Many people in Greece work more than eight hours a day. Uh, I think that uh, uh, half of them is like this. And uh, half of the others uh, don't have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, now we're gonna play a game. We're gonna separate into teams. Who is pro uh, manifestations and believes that uh, the strikes can really invert the power relationships? And who doesn't believe so? So we're gonna form two different teams. One team who is up for it and believes that strikes can be useful as a uh, power tool to invert power relationships. So, our relationships should come over here, and if other people who don't believe that, they should go over there.
Okay. Καλυπηρέψουμε οι υπερφόρμες. Εδώ. Πείτε το εδώ. Δεν θέλω να μιλάω στα αγγλικά και... Όχι. Και θα να πω χωρίς γιατί δεν θέλω να μιλήσω στα αγγλικά. We can translate for you. Απλά πώς θα φτιάξεις. Θέλεις να πάω. Μια χαρά είναι, αλλά δεν ήξερα ότι θα γίνει με αυτή τη διαδικασία. Θα πάω. Για αυτή θα είναι συμμετοχικό. Okay. Um, I think that at the what I think Sprite's action can be a positive thing, but in general, what the Sprites, the way I understand them. They are actually working on dealing with the symptoms and not actually the problem itself. And the problem is that, I mean, obviously there are many different problems in many different situations, but it's rather, it's important that we all, in whichever area that we live, that we take back control of our areas and I think strikes might be able to do that, but in general, the system where that we have now is it's very difficult to actually say that the strikes are going to actually make things better because I don't know what actually that the Greek government can actually do to change things as long as they're within an international system, which is the European Union, which is then very I mean, obviously, it's been, I think that it's based more on dialogue than on the strikes don't really solve problems. So you don't you don't belong to any of these categories? Pardon? You don't want to belong to any of these categories? No. Why? Because I don't speak very well English and I don't understand. Pro strike against strike. Pro strike. Pro strike. So you should go over there. <laughs> so you should stay with them.
Okay, so as a way to test in a way these two positions, uh, I would propose that we take the score and we take the interpretation of each group according to their own ideas. Sometimes, or more, the most in our times, strike is only uh, to show or to feel good, to think you have power, but actually you don't have power when you address the wrong people uh, with the strike. Are you working? Yes, I'm working, yes. Are you striking? Uh, yes, I think I have my way, uh, ways to strike, but uh, I am now students sometimes the students strike and they strike for half a year or for a year, year and they don't allow other students to come to the university and I was part of this uh, in Germany I was part of the movement and uh, uh, usually I know that the power people uh, they laugh they say oh uh, it's, it's wonderful they strike but it doesn't uh, matter to me because I do my old games uh, like every day, maybe the bankers do the same game, uh, like before, and they make the money, and uh, maybe uh, they had good reason to say, oh, uh, uh, the people don't like to work, they, uh, they are not busy, they are lazy, or something like that, and then uh, they have good reasons, good publicity uh, to make their old games. So I think uh, um, maybe we have to think about the actions we do. Maybe we like the symbolic way of uh, the action, uh, and they are right. But I think the aim of the strike is right. I'm not against the, uh, the purpose. Uh, but I don't believe uh, that, uh, in, the, in, the, in the symbolic form. And what's the solution for you? What? What is the solution for you? Um, I don't really know, but I think uh, it has to do something with money, uh, with the money system. Uh, and uh, uh, the powerful symbols are the money. And uh, it must be an action that uh, changes the money system or disturbs the money system, uh, but not uh, an action that, that, that disturbs the people. Money! 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 Money. 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 
माने 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 Those people who uh, uh, choose or elect the left, uh, the right, uh, they uh, feel uh, outside. Uh, they feel that they don't uh, 
get in touch with the society, the, the, with the globalization, and uh, uh, they, they want to get a symbol, and the party is a symbol. Right? Yeah. And, and, and that is for me the feeling uh, that uh, also the left or the people who criticize the society, they don't know what to do. Right? So they don't know the solution. Uh, and this is the question with the strike. Uh, maybe uh, uh, I go to the street and uh, say, oh, I'm against everything, uh, but uh, I don't know how to change it. Right? That's the problem. I don't have the address. Right? I don't have the... Maybe if, uh, if we have a dictator or, or, or something, or a capitalist or something, uh, we could address and I could go there, I could uh, make a strike and um, uh, work that the factory doesn't uh, work anymore or something like that. Uh, but uh, how to do this uh, today in a globalized society? Shouldn't we ask also people that they are less likely to talk here to tell us their opinion about uh, if, if the strike and why the strike is uh, important for them? Could you tell us? Mm, I think that um, obviously they cannot change the system, but um, there are a kind of weapon in order to gain some things. So I think uh, they have a meaning and uh, there are a, a way of communication. What do you think? way to express what is where what, what is the demand what like it's, it's like a symbolic form of expression yeah but if, if this this thing as the man said before doesn't have something new to suggest yeah. doesn't have any other option what's the point Like to open a dialogue and to find a response. That's, that's the sense of the demonstration. And how in demonstration open the dialogue? Um, to have People. <laughs> <laughs> and instead of strikes, what is the best? I think that it's the most important thing is that we actually then get to a point where we, the, the basic problem I see is that is the capitalist system. The capitalist system is, is as a problem that people, when they have money, that it, they, have, they actually can earn interest without even doing anything. And so what has to actually happen is that the interest that, that we have to create a system where, where you have at least negative interest, and so that it's not that, that people with money actually then can make more money without doing anything. And that's where, the, where I say that the strikes, what happens is it's within the system and you're basically then fighting within the system and we have to go to a point where we don't, where, where we, but it has to be a dialectical system. And a dialectical system is where you then work and fight work together, people have to then get together and find out what really has to be done. I mean, this is just my idea, but that we have to then say, okay, we get rid of then 
we get rid of positive interest, we make interest negative. There are different ways of doing it. It's called, um, it's called, uh, well, in Wörter, I can't remember what the word is, but it's Freigeld. And, um, and that way that we can actually then develop a new system where, where the capitalists don't get fatter automatically. And that's how then actually I think that our society can become more just. That's... So we have to think of how we're going to do that. Yes, we have to think of how we do it. We have to then actually, and the strikes at the moment, which I see is it just is in, within, the, within the system and it's then we're trying to just, I don't know, obviously just fighting within the system that's now, we have to get past that system and get to another system. But it, it, it's based upon discussion within society, so that people actually. And where understand. does society discuss? The, the, the society discusses where, when you have, you actually have to then create grassroots, grassroots movements, where you actually have people that get together and say, "We don't want this anymore. We're going to take back. We're going to take back our money. We're going to take back the, the money system, the monetary system, and it's not going to be then a system where it's just uh, with with interest and compounded interest." and such. That, that's my opinion. What about you? Did you notice that someone left? Yes. Why did they leave? Because they didn't speak English. And why did you, why did you not translate for them? We could all have. They did. And? What was their answer? No answer? They just left? And we didn't even say goodbye, why are you leaving? We're having a conversation here. You said you would uh, give us an account. We? Yes, I thought you said you will be asked, why are you leaving? You might be asked. To you might. Yeah. So, what's your uh, position in this subject? I would like to know why they left. Why did they left? Because I felt that they don't have the agency to. Since you are exercising so much control of the situation, I thought it's something that uh, you should bring up. What do you believe about strikes or no strikes? What, uh, you are up for strikes, why? I think it's good for people to complain. So, as a minimum, if this is what the strike does, good. That's why I support it. Okay, you have total control of everything. You can make us do whatever we, you want. You can interpret the score. You can do whatever you like here. Okay, let me start by... You have the agency. Okay, let me start by moving up with this bright light. Mm -hmm. yeah. And how about those cameras? Do we like them? I mean, I feel, that, I feel the separation between the people. When I'm speaking to you, when you hold this like this, I feel the... Am I the only one who does this? The wall is very big. The wall is really large that you project. Uh, it's not, it's very uncomfortable. It's crazy. And it feels not inclusive. And it's uh, very... Um, yeah, it's, 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 it's really dictatorial. <laughs> right, like it's it's a, almost a, an aggressive act, uh, and and it violates the personal space. Well, we right, like the filming okay. and all that is very. Uh, all along, mm -hmm. we have been talking about ways of demonstrating. Yeah, yeah. What but do also, you exercise? What do you stand for? We do. We're talking. Well, we're we're here right now. We're, we're chosen to be here with you. So. What you do it and. Now it's going to a point where I'm like not cool with it anymore. I think you should turn the camera off and not use the light. This is because about dissonance though, it's not about pleasure. It, it's, it's, a, it's not a good atmosphere. It doesn't encourage I You don't give a fuck about your yeah, personal space. I don't space. have a problem with bad atmosphere, I just want to address it. Okay, well, you can keep on going. Should, though, because but you want to have dialogue. You know, if you yeah, want the sides to talk, you can't do this. I think it's fine. And we should I think we go in a, uh, the camera. to a place where there's social dissonance that you see, and uh, then <laughs> we should expect that uh, we go in a place where there's social dissonance. And I think uh, it's fine to moderate it uh, in a way that the, the dissonance will be yeah. up. Uh, and that's it's the, the, my expectation. No, no, I agree with your thoughts, and I would like to answer from your point. 
as you say, this uh, the other answer, mm -hmm. uh, the, the other solution, except try, is uh, every day to express your disagreements with language. Like I'd like to hear her. But every day. Why would you why, why would you express the disagreement No, no, I won't. I think that uh, every, uh, every, everyone ought to, to do this in order to not to um, express in, uh, yeah, suppress it. And uh, maybe um, this, uh, this will be a more um, this will be an, an action, an everyday action, and uh, maybe, maybe this. Um, how can we express it? Um, uh, would be. Uh, how does it go? Effective. Uh, more effective. <laughs> That's why. And uh, the strike, uh, I think that uh, uh, a lot of strikes uh, take part. Uh, because uh, everyone don't do this, don't express the disagreement in the uh, the work, in uh, the personal life, everywhere. Spears, what do you think? Well, <clears throat> Is this a productive conversation? Yeah, 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 yeah. I think it was going somewhere uh, when we were talking about the cons and pros of strike as a power tool. But then uh, the guy in black kind of derailed it. it is somewhat like a strike and it's promoting the dialogue so whether it's it, it may come off as aggressive but at least there is discussion yeah. it may not be the most um, the outcome it may take longer to get to um, uh, to get to a mutual agreement but it starts the discussion and there's frustration. So. Right. It's a form of expression, so I think it's yeah. it's valid. No, no. And I think it's valid for them to impose it on us so we can feel what they're feeling. It's my interpretation. Yeah. I mean, if you walk through the city, you can see it. <laughs> An experiment of manipulation. I mean, you react in a in a way which is very aggressive, and we are in a defensive. Defensive. We are defensive, and uh, this guy here suddenly express uh, an argument, and uh, we start to bring arguments uh, about all this. It is very uh, pressing. It is very pressing. So I feel like I'm in an, uh, an experiment of manipulation. <laughs> Yeah. 
experiment manipulation. Experiment manipulation. Experiment of manipulation. Experiment of manipulation. Experiment of manipulation. 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 Come on, everybody, let's dance. Experiment of manipulation. Experiment of manipulation. Experiment of manipulation. Manipulation. Experiment. 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 Experiment of manipulation. Experiment of manipulation. Experiment, experiment. I believe that people are angry about Documenta because uh, it, in uh, their opinion it has an orientalistic view about uh, Greece and imposes an orientalistic view and uh, is, Documenta is using the, cri the Greek crisis as a background for art and this in the opinion of a lot of people is aesthetization of the crisis and uh, this is why people are discontent, discontent about the commenter. Uh, it also has a lot of contradictions like I suppose as contemporary art has and every field of contemporary literature and endeavors, whatever, you know, like everything is so contradictory. And also Documenta is part of this con huge contradiction in regards to grassroots and in the same time uh, is a, an exhibition uh, made with a lot of money and German money especially. And uh, I think this is uh, very problematic and uh, people are discontent also about that. What do you think? I think that the question about the striking is, was very effective and uh, people had to say a lot of things and actually um, I guess that there has to be a public space where people express their opinion and their 
uh, disagreement with some things that are going on uh, in yeah uh, as as far as their labor is concerned of course and I, I cannot understand how we will be able to speak about another solution if we don't find this uh, public spaces to to form this to you know to discuss about it but apart from all this there was another question that we are like six people working here and on a day of strike and i thought that somebody would mention something about it and maybe we should have done because it is a question why we are working today because yeah it, it is would be another uh, good uh, discussion about cultural workers for example and stuff like that but after but what yeah what i wanted to say is that um yeah the disagreements also made a point after all okay i forgot the other thing i wanted to say I think that we should have tried more practical methods and <clears throat> try to implement the theories that were uh, discussed in practice. Like, for example, the people that uh, went for striking to try and implement that, uh, that method in this space. I also thought that we should have questioned the fact that we are uh, five, four people, or maybe six people, uh, talking about Greek crisis and about striking while being paid by the German government at the same time. And I think this is very, we should have talked about that more. I remember one of what I wanted to say. Yeah, I wanted to say what, what is more that sometimes it makes me wonder a little bit about how people perceive violence in this room and aggressiveness. And I, I can understand that we uh, this context can be aggressive and make people feel uncomfortable. And okay, of course, this is part of what we're doing. I, I'm not, I don't want to discuss about this, but I just want, I, I just uh, think a lot about uh, how different people find different things aggressive. For example, Greek people uh, almost never find what is going on in here aggressive. And I was thinking that, um, you know, violence is a very, um, very, is it cool? Yeah, very relative thing to what you uh, experience. And for example, yeah, I, I, I understand the aggressiveness, but it, it is a little bit weird to me that people fight vi could find violent, you know, the camera or being asked some questions. And in the same time, like there are some people working for two euros uh, per hour and striking and this is going on in the same city in the same time and you know what is violence after all is that violent or is you know paying all your money to taxes violent <laughs>